Okay. I'm going to try and shoot this straight through. Happy Dog Farm, and I am creating a second press tray for the cider press that I've done on earlier videos. What I'm trying to do is make a tray that is a little bit easier to drain since the stock tray that I bought from a manufacturer has a drain that goes up from the bottom and probably has 3 8 of crown. Well, there's a lot of juice laying on the bottom of 3 8 of crown, and I don't want to mess with that. It also drains straight out the bottom, which means I need to get a bucket underneath it. That's sort of a hassle, too. I would rather have something that came off from the side and I got a little bit more for bucket. What I have is a fitting. Uh, I used to uh, play around on boats. This is a marine fitting made out of the same plastic as this. And it's cycloidal. And it also goes perfectly flush and has a very, very low profile. The hole that it goes through is 1.617 thousandths of an inch. 1.617 inches, which is 8 thousandths of an inch smaller than a 1 in 5 eighths inch drill bit. Now, lesson learned from all this. When you get something, don't think that you can kind of make it bigger. Just don't do that. Spend the money, buy the right drill bit. The investment between th these two items is over $100. The drill bit came out to be chump change, so you want to do that. Um, when you buy the bit, you will probably need the right spindle to put it on. And regrettably, mine requires the use of a half-inch drill gun. And when you're going to place the fitting, one thing that's really important is, you notice it's got a shoulder on it. So you can't presume you're going to be drilling in the corner. You're not. You're going to have to drill out from the corner a little bit. So you need to set it and give yourself a little bit of room here so that it can sit in flush and do its job. Now I'm going to go for the side because remember I already got one that goes straight down. Second thing you want to do is don't hook it up to the drill and guess what's going to give you a flush with the bottom. That's not going to work. Put it together. Lay it flush. Remember, you found out where the right spot was, and hand turn and push it. The tap bit, which is what keeps the whole thing assembled, assembly solid, is going to make that first starter hole. And that starter hole, well, it didn't quite come through all the way, but I can fix that because I'm a geek, and you are too. So I take that off now. And I want to finish hand turning that hole so now it came through. There. Yep, hole came through. Now I'm not going to try and get my drill gun in from inside the, um, the tray. That's just a hole is a hole. Um, what's really important is the hole is where you want it to be. If I try to get the drill gun inside the tray, I would wiggle. Um, I wouldn't get it lined up properly, but I've got that hole, and that hole's under the side, so if I make a nice, clean, straight shot, that's going to work. You know, of course, you realize if I mess this up, you're all going to get to watch me do it and laugh. I'm going to take the tray, put my satellite receiver someplace else. I'm just going to lay the tray like this, and you can't see it, but that hole's right here. Mm, isn't that impressive? <laughs> I'm going to go a little slower. And I'm going to put my knee on it. And uh, you guys can kind of see that. You realize I'm terrified. <laughs> Okay, there's the hole. Yes, I will vacuum up afterward. Why am I doing this in my basement? You know, what guys do. Anyway, there's the hole, and I am pleased to say that, po that's, that puppy lines up nicely. Now, let's just see if it did as well as I had said it would. Well, 
There it is, perfectly flush. I don't know how well you can see in there, but it's nice and smooth, it's tight, just a hair of a gap on the bottom. I will be using a FDA approved 100% silicon sealant to close this up and it will cure and I'll pot it. I'll leave it for the whole time before I ever expose it to the cider. But what I've got now is something where that juice can drain and just go straight out. And I've also got a fitting that I can hook a hose to. So I get a little bit more flexibility in how I can control the juice coming out. So, yay, huh? Well, the information about the fitting, the tray, heck, I'll even tell you about the drill bit. It's an Irwin 41 millimeter, 1 and 5 eighths inch drill bit. It's pretty cool, huh? Big long part number. And I bought it on the internet. Check out the internet sometime. It's really cool. Anyway, this is Al from Happy Dog Farm. Thank you for sharing a win. So far, two wins. Okay, thank you.